Hi everybody and welcome to Herefordshire. We're down here for a week for a family get together. We're going to be doing a little bit of exploring as well, doing a few little walks and a few stopovers. So hopefully give you guys a good idea of, of where to visit if you're down in this area. So today we are very close to the Welsh border and we've come to climb Black Hill via Cats Ridge, which is a very cool little ridge because on one side you've got Herefordshire and the very flat sort of landscape of Herefordshire and then on the other side you've got the, the start of the Brecon Beacons. Yeah, the landscape is amazing. You can basically see the whole of Herefordshire behind us it's, it's stunning we've got a very clear day as well yeah we're gonna do a little circular walk all the way around maybe even get over to the Welsh border and hop across so this landscape reminds us a lot of when we did the Macclesfield forest walk and you had the very clear distinction between Peak District and the Cheshire Plain. Very flat and then very hilly. And again here you've got the, the Brecon Beacons just popping up out of nowhere. And then you come over this way and you get the flat Herefordshire countryside. So there's a very big visual distinction between the two. Okay, so we're just coming towards the end of our Black Hill Circular Walk now. Oh, it's such a beautiful walk. I loved it. The views yeah. were amazing. It's just such an easy one to do to get amazing views out over Herefordshire and, and the Brecon Beacons. Like, you can basically park at the base of the ridge. That initial little bit up to the ridge is quite steep. And that's the only only problem, I would say. Once you're up on the ridge, it's, it's really easy. Really and the views on a day like this, if you get a nice day, you can see for miles. Definitely highly recommend doing it. Yeah, we're going to head back to the car now and we're going to head off to our next destination. So we will see you there. So Hereford is the county town of Herefordshire and will likely be your base when you're exploring the county. The town is located on River Wye and is well known for its cider, sausage rolls and famous Hereford breed rolls. Hereford is also home to many beautiful attractions. Make sure to visit Hereford Cathedral, which dates back to 1079 and houses the Mapamundi, a 13th century map of the world, as well as being home to the largest library of chain books in the world. A 
Another distinct spot is the old black and white house in the centre of the city. This building was built in 1621 and after being restored in the 19th century is now a museum about life in the Jacobean era. After waking up to the most incredible sunrise, we hopped in the car and headed for the Welsh border town of Hay on Wye. Whilst not technically in Herefordshire, we couldn't miss seeing this small market town commonly known as the town of books. With over 20 bookstores ranging from modern to quirky and everything in between, this town is definitely a must see if you are an avid reader like us. On our final day in Herefordshire, we stopped at the gorgeous market town of Ludlow on our way home. Located just across the border in Shropshire, Ludlow may not be in Herefordshire, but just like Hay and Y, it's easily doable as a day trip if you're staying in Hereford, and it's well worth a visit. The town was described by an English poet as probably the loveliest town in England and it's easy to see why. The town has over 500 listed buildings, a medieval walled town and in the centre of it all, Ludlow Castle. So the fortress was probably founded in the late 11th century and stands on a rocky outcrop of the River Team. Now managed by English Heritage, it's described as one of the finest castle sites in England. Make sure to wander down to Dinham Bridge to get the iconic view with the castle in the background. Thanks for watching our Herefordshire video, we hope you enjoyed it. Before we go, we just wanted to share a little footage from the gorgeous accommodation that we stayed in for the week. This is not sponsored, but we just loved our stay so much, we had to share it in case any of you guys were interested. We stayed at Cothill Barns to the west of Hereford, which is located in the most picture-perfect valley. They have two properties available to book, both of which are big enough for large families, and even a games room where you can go to chill out in the evening after a long day exploring the county. We can highly recommend staying here and we will leave a link to the website in the description of this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and we will see you on our next adventure.